Lola's. Welcome back to my channel. Oh my gosh, are you so loud? Okay guys, if you're new to this channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. Don't forget to leave me a comment and give this video a thumbs up. If you're not a part of my channel membership, paid membership, make sure you join. Okay? Um, there's two tiers. There's one for $1.99. Um, and that is video only content and I guess some little updates. And then the tier for $4.99, which is next level, is some background, vlogging, um, live streams, videos, updates, so on and so forth. So today, so that's the $4.99, that's called the next level Lola's tier. And if not, stay right here in the gym pop. And let's rumble. No. Anyway, I have baby Lanny here. And Lanny is a baby that I was painting in, doing some of the painting in the uh, chatterbox. And so um, this baby is adopted out. And all these lights. Yeah. Let me see. We're we doing too much. We're doing too much. We're doing. All right. Anyway. I'm going to get him on a diaper. Um, I've got him weighted and I'm going to put him in a sleeper. And I am going to, off camera, pack his bags. He will get to travel home soon. Um, so I'll just let his mom know so that she can go ahead and clear his balance. Because all I did was take a reserve. Sometimes when my babies are... Um, when the babies are not finished, I just ask for a reserve to hold the baby. And so that once the baby is completed, then the mom, you know, will be responsible for the balance. Sometimes I do that. But once babies are already ready to go, a lot of times I do ask for just full payment. And the reason why I don't really do layaway and holds a lot of times is because, you know, I have had people not follow through so um i know it kind of sucks sometime for those that do keep their their word but you know when you when you're like depending on the income of a sale and <laughs> someone backs out on you you know it's it's kind of it kind of hurts um so you know, unless it's, of course, the seller, you know, because of the seller, then, you know, you have to adjust to it if it's, you know, but, yeah. So, anyway, get on his little diaper. Oh, my guinea. You get on your diaper. I am going to put, I was trying to, I like for my babies to travel as covered up as possible so I'm going to put him on the sleeper because you know again I just prefer them to be as covered as possible and sleepers always seem to do the best at that you know you put them in the sleeper their little feet their hands everything's covered up put a little diaper on their head and they're good wrap them in a nice cozy blanket and it's getting cool outside too, so he definitely need to be bundled. Like he's gonna have to be bundled, baby. He ain't have to be warm. You never had to be warm. Warm. You need to be warm. <laughs> um. So he. This is a newborn sleeper. He could fit some zero to three month stuff if it's cut small. Cause I don't know. Like I keep saying in all my videos. Um, lately, zero to three have been more like three to six to me in some, some clothes now. I don't know if they just assuming that we're bigger now, so they've changed the clothes size. I guess that's what it is. I don't know. But, yeah. So, we will see. But, he is all... Ready to go get his bags packed. 
Um, next step will be doing his paperwork. So I'll g gather all his little paperwork, his COA. Um, cause I only paint authentic kits. So I'll go ahead and get his COA and get his, uh, his certificates from me and get him all ready to go. Look how dad, oh, you look good in that color. That color look good on you. A little chub chub. So, and then I got to make sure he has a pacifier that works with him. That's works with his magnetized, hized little mouth. Um, his pacifier, the magnet, you can see it's a magnet in there. Um, I put it under the chin so that it'll help the pacifier sit, fit flush. Um, to his mouth, but um, but yeah, so that is it. So that is Mr. Lanny, he is going home. We don't know what his name is going to be, so I'm going to make sure his eyes are good and sparkling clean because I'm looking on now, I look like they got a little haze on them. So I'll do that before he go. And then, oh yeah, and I'll put these, uh, I'll flip these down on his little hands. These are his little hands. And I'll flip these down. But I sent mom some pictures of him before I put him together. And then I just took some pictures of him in his cloth. So that will probably be it for this little guy. Um, I know sometimes mommies want me to take a lot of pictures and do a lot of videos, but I, I don't do it on every single baby, especially um, when I'm trying to get to the next project and go ahead and get the baby shipped out. What did I just do? What did I just do? Yeah, I just, you know, usually you'll find me taking more videos, more pictures of the ones that was in my collection and I sold them and that's you know because they were my personal babies so I just like to mention that sometimes because some people are like, oh she didn't take a lot of pictures of my baby or she didn't video this baby as much or blah 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 well if I painted them to sell they pretty much are leaving me i love this sculpt so much um which is why i am going to have one back in my collection some of you guys may not know but i am waiting hopefully once he is located um and i'll talk about that in another video um but stay tuned thanks for watching bye bye